Hello everyone, it's Jen here, the Diamond Painting Gamer. Very warm welcome to my channel. And as you can see, I've got another one of my random picks coming. I've got one of my boxes of tags out. So if you are new or um, if you are returning after, you know, a, a, a while, basically if you haven't see, seen any of my videos so far this year, um, I am doing all my diamond painting project projects this year um randomly. Okay, I'm I'm doing a complete random selection. The only um control I've got over it is whether or not it's a budget kit or a premium company kit. And today our random pick is uh, one of these yellow tags and these are from the premium kit collection so um, these are all like key fob tags they're numbered from 1 to 100 um, premium kits what is a premium kit well in my eyes a premium kit is from a company that holds licensed artwork um, the kits are a little bit more pricey, the quality is a lot better, okay? So we're talking about companies like Diamond Art Club, Diamond Art Studio, Diamond Painting Fanatics, Dreamer Designs, um, I've got some Crafties, I've got some Treasure Studios Art. I've got, I've got a reasonably decent selection of kits from what I would consider a premium company. Um, if I do, when I do draw one of these, you probably won't see any new kits. Um, I am on a no buy this year. We're in halfway through June. I haven't bought any diamond paintings at all from any premium companies since, I wanna say Black Friday, but I might have picked something up in December. I can't really remember. But yeah, it's been a good six months. Anyway, um, let us uh, give this a little sugar and see what we pick, what we uh, pick out the box. So uh, you might want to cover your ears because this can get a bit noisy. So diamond paintings were all numbered at random. Um, I must, I will say, this is not all my premium kits. So there are a huge chunk of Diamond Art Clubs that uh, haven't got a number on it. Um, so it's got about half of my Diamond Art Club kits in it. Not all of them. I don't know what number's what. Anyway, let us pull out a number. We have got number 47. Uh, ooh, I've got a feeling this might be a big diamond art club. I've got a feeling. I might be wrong. Okay, let's see what 47 is. Um, I'll just go and dig it out uh, back in a second. Yeah, hopefully it's not too big. The last one was massive. Okay, I'm back. It actually didn't take that long for me to find. And I was actually wrong. And I'm so happy that I was wrong. It is not a Diamond Art Club. It's actually Diamond Painting Fanatics. And I'm really happy because this is the first Diamond Painting Fanatics canvas I've drawn out this year. So I am so pleased. I'm also pleased because it's a kitty cat. Uh, here we go, number 47. Uh, you can't quite see it all. Let me see if I can zoom out a little bit more. Oops, wrong way. Kenny is behind me. I'll probably jump. Hopefully, he won't jump up on the table. Um, it's this cute cat. Isn't this gorgeous? Okay, it's called a uh, nap time. Here we go. Up in the top corner nap time it's 50 by 60 so that's quite good not too big um the artist is fanara um this uh, is an older canvas however 
this is still available in the store um it's just it's had a rebrand um new supplier uh so uh, although you can still get this image it won't be exactly the way that i have it uh this is a round it has got uh, 37 colors we have got branding at the bottom and also at the top but as i said the one you get will be slightly different if you want to get this painting sorry i had to pause and restart um because kenny started clambering about and he jumped up to the window on the windowsill and knocked everything off so uh, i wasn't too sure where i had got to when i had when i had stopped um i think i mentioned about the fact that uh, you can still get this painting however it's a new supplier now and they come differently. So yours will, if you were to choose this painting, it will be slightly different to mine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to talk you through what I have. And then um, if you like this image, you can go to the website, the Diamond Painting Fanatics website, and you can look and see what's available uh, or how this comes uh, now or currently. Um, I have chosen a round. For this one um, again this is the old way everything came so it is a uh, there we go nap time picture 50 by 60. let's have a look at our colors this is how i like my animals my cats i like them to be very realistic looking and that's what we have here So yes, yeah, very, very different now to, to, to what I have. Just bear that in mind. So here we go. Nap Time by Fanara. 15, 50 by 60 round. We have got, uh, how many colours did I say? 37 colours. And there are three ABs as well. So we'll uh, look at the colours. It's a very neutral uh, and muted colour palette because it is a lifelike image of a kitten. There's not going to be any sparkly blues and yellows and oranges and reds and all that in here. It's all going to be quite um, toned down. So uh, let's look and see the colours and let's look and see the ABs. We'll see where the ABs go because that's really the most interesting thing, isn't it? So, yeah. Our colour palette is going to be quite, let me scooch this slightly over to this side and then we can lay the drills out here. So yeah, we're going to have lots of browns, peaches, more browns, it's a blue, it's a grey. We've got some browns and uh, burgundies. So yeah, lots and lots of browns. There's a little bit of green down there. Oh, we can't quite see. A little bit of green, more green. We've got some foliage going on, don't we? Right, that's a, that's an AB, that's an AB, that's an AB. Uh, we've got some greys, more browns. Uh, so more browns. So yeah, browns and greys, some greens going on because our little kitten is having a nap in a tree browns and greens greys um, that's some more greys and some more browns oops and some more greens Quite a big bag of 310 going on here. Up at the top. And the cream grey. So yeah, as I said, very neutral colour palette. Browns, greys, um, creams, a little bit of peach here. Uh, some greens for the foliage, um, some blue. Again, I would imagine that's for like shading. Oh, we do, however, have a little bit of sparkle because we like a little bit of sparkle, don't we? So we have got three sets of ABs. 
So we have an 823AB, and the 823 is like a dark blue. We have a 413AB, which is a grey. And we have a 3823AB, which is a sort of a, kind of a dark cream, almost like a buttermilk type colour. Um, the if, if you were to get this painting now, you may not necessarily get the same enhancements and in the same place. Because um, Cindy at Diamond Painting Fanatics um, has redone the way that she does enhancements. So she's got lots of different types of drills, not just ABs, just pixie powder and glitter drills and crystals. So I think you can add enhancements, your own enhancements, as how you would like it. But, um, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> as I was saying, let us get, uh, let's find out where our ABs go. Let's get our sheet so we can get the, uh, get the values. Uh, so AB8823 is like the half, like a half moon, like a, 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 a part of a bracket actually, you know, that symbol, like a bracket. Let me see what, let me see what this is. Maybe I should have done this, look for them before I am um, actually, uh, oh, oh, I found them up here. A little bit here. So in the background, I can't see any in the cat itself. Nope. Uh, but it does all. It does go with. Um, it's just seven four six. There it is. It it, it isn't the same area as this J. So these are going to be next to one another. So we've got sort of J's here as well, and here and here. So that's going to look lovely. Uh, we have the blue AB 823 and that symbol Q. And Q is, okay, we've got a little bit up here at the top of the head. And So we got Q. Mm. Oh, here, just at the background. I think what we've got is we've got the light coming down from this side. So because we've got the light coming down from here, this is where a lot of our ABs are going to be. So here in the background, um, a little bit at the top of the head. Just a little bit round here at the ear, tip of the ear. So just sort of like the light's just catching um, certain places. The last one is the grey. And our grey is a 413, which is a symbol is a 3. Let's see if we can find our 3s. I'd imagine it's all kind of might be up here as well, but I can't see it. Um, so if I look, I've got a creaky table. Oh, I found my threes. I found them. They seem to be down here. So uh, here we go. We've got some threes here in the background. And uh, down here. And some here. What do we have? Do we have 413? No, we don't. I thought we might have had 413 in um in regular drills, but we don't. So here's three, and there's some over here. So it's on in the background, sort of underneath the branch area. So with, with the exception of a couple of um blue ones just at the tips of the ears here. And um, here, uh, we don't actually have any ABs in the cat itself. It's more in the background, which, in in my opinion, I I prefer. If you've got um a realistic looking animal, 
um I, I don't like I don't like to see babies in it it's I'm funny that way uh, it's the same with faces and people I don't like seeing ABs and faces it's one of my pet peeves is ABs ABs and faces but I'm cool with this you know with the, with the background and you know where it kind of catches the light catches the fur slightly oh wow I am super happy to be doing a diamond painting fanatics canvas as I said it's it's my first one uh, this year that I've pulled out Cindy <laughs> Cindy you'll be happy <laughs> I've been uh, Cindy's actually a really really good friend of mine um and I've been apologizing to her for the last six months going I'm so sorry I've not pulled one of your canvases out from a random picks and she's like oh no don't worry about it you know I know that you're doing your year of randomness my time will come well Cindy your time has come now and it's a uh, it's gorgeous nap time okay so uh, once again quick uh, recap of uh, my next premium canvas kit uh, we have nap time it's a 50 by 60 it's a round diamond painting the artist is Fanara it's this gorgeous little tabby who's asleep in a tree um, it has a 37 colours, very, very muted colour palette, not very bright at all, but then you would expect it. It's a realistic sort of like photo image of a, a cat sleeping in a tree. <laughs> You're not going to have wild and wacky colours there. But yeah, 37 colours, three ABs. It's around. Um, I'm so excited to get started on this. Uh, it is highly unlikely you will see this. I've got my own cat here in the background. It is highly unlikely you will see this um, at the end of June uh, with my June finishes. Mm, you never know. You never know. <laughs> you might. You might. I've, uh, you, I've got. I've, I'm off work now for the remainder of June, but I'm actually going away for a week, so. You might not see it, but if, but if you don't see it at the end of June, you'll definitely see it all at the end of July. I'll, I'll show you a wee recap of, of, of where I'm up to in June anyway with it. Awesome. So happy to be doing Diamond Painting Fanatics Canvas. Anyway, thank you very, very much uh, for giving me your time. What do you think of this canvas? Um, do you like uh, Diamond? Have you got any Diamond Painting Fanatics canvases? I think probably quite a few of you do. Um, this is Fanara. Um, she's a fantastic artist. Do you have any paintings by her? Do you have any of uh, similar paintings to this? Because there, there's there were um a few of these style on the website when I ordered this. So anyway, I'm rambling on. I've got my own cat to see too because he's meowing at the back there here, and I uh, also need to go out to the shop to pick up something for my own tea. That's it. I'm off. See you in the next video. Have a lovely weekend. Cheerio!